Hello folks, welcome back to the Tesla Test Bench channel. I'll be your host today, Damien D. Moron, and we have yet another Tesla drive unit running. Let's go take a look. So what we have for you today is a little bit of a Tesla mishmash. We have our rear drive unit inverter with our modified V2 board. Still haven't ordered the V3s yet, but will be in a few days time. And we have it wired up, not to my usual rear drive unit, oh no. Over here, beside my compressor pump, we have a front drive unit. A little bit of foam stuck into the um, CV shaft output, so if I give it some gas, spin Elon, spin. So we get rotation. So we can now drive our front and rear Model 3 drive units from the open inverter Model 3 logic board. Exciting, but that's not all today folks look at what I have for you here in the middle on the left we have exhibit a one standard uh, Tesla CV cup on the right in beautiful PTG we have a 3d print of a design that's uh, currently being undertaken by Brat Industries for a, mo a model 3 drive unit uh, CV flange. So let's go ahead and see if we can put some CV flanges into this front motor. What could possibly go wrong? All right, let's pop the standard one in the far side. There's nothing really to see here. It's, de it's designed to fit, so it should. Little bit of a uh, there we go, Elon, old buddy. There you go. Bash that in there. I suppose it would have helped if I had actually um, printed it in a less black color. There we go. So there you have it folks. Just another short at the old Model 3 test bench for you. Hopefully in the next non-fun packed episode, we will have the V3 board. So what that basically means is that now our open inverter board uh, can run both the rear and the front Model 3 drive unit motors. So that's pretty good. So I also have a dedicated Model 3 inverter here as so we'll be putting our be three board in that once we get them in so I won't uh, keep you any longer from those very important funny cat videos uh, so until next time folks the usual thumbs down give it a solid dislike unsubscribe don't support me don't visit the links in the description just don't do anything and um, but maybe block me so that then you don't get notifications that I'm that I'm here making more stupid videos because who wants that? Okay. And until next time then. Happy current inducing. <laughs>